Hello? Uh, What's up, bro? How are you? Pick the night on my on my premiere like that. That was. I'm sorry, bro. Well, I'm a little late. You know, I'm having a. You know. I figured. I, I, I too much going on, man. I, the show's coming on. The show's on right now. I got pulled from the show. I forgot the interview. You know. So. Definitely. What's up, Chief? Same thing as I need. Can I use this for one sec? Absolutely. All right, talk to me, boss. Well, how you feeling, bro? It's a big night tonight. Man, I, I mean, I, I was. I mean, shoot. You see, I'm late, don't I? Yeah, you're good. Yeah. You're good. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little late, but I was, uh, you know, I was, I, was, I was trying to turn on the show. My bad. I was trying to turn on the show. I was trying to check it out and see what was going on with this here episode. So my manager was like, bro, you better get on that interview. I'm like, interview? I said, oh, dog, dog. So, you know, hold on, hold on. I'm good. I can't sit it down like this. And I do what I need to do. You know, you I'm going to sit him on the side. You want me hold it? Yeah, you can do that. Okay. Can we see you? How you look? Bam. 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 <laughs> how we doing, man? How you doing, doggy? Good, good. Yeah, I wanted to tell you, though. Like, how have you been, though, in this whole crazy lockdown and stuff? How have you been feeling? And how's, every, how's life? Uh, life is good. Life is, you know, I'm a part of the quarantine, bro. I'm a part of the COVID, so like everybody else, you know, so I can only enjoy so much. One thing I am enjoying is the show. I was going to say, like, everyone is talking about this show. Every single person I know Number one. About. Number one. Number one. Exactly. It deserves to be number one no matter what, because it is definitely one of the best shows in a long time. So, like, Thank how did you, you get set up? Like, Thank how did you, you get the talks with Zeus and get it, you know, get it going? Say that again? How'd you get it going? Like, how did you, like, meet with Man, the Man, I got network? it going with a lot of, uh, 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 uh. First of all, I got it going by staying clean cut, staying safe, staying prayed up, keeping God first. Mm -hmm. Keeping my dreams at the forefront, you know? Yeah. As I started healing my brother and I started looking at this company, this company, I, I went over here and shot a little demo reel. You know what I mean? That didn't work uh -huh. out. So I had hit my boy, actually Jackie Long hit me and said, hey man, you still working on that project you you got, man? Come to Zeus, come to Death Row. I said, yeah. ha, here I come, baby. <laughs> Well, yeah, I want to tell you, like, you got some awesome characters on the show. Like, that's exactly Yami. what happened to Mark. Characters. Oh, my. Amazing, though. Like, Yami's amazing. Mangina is just crazy and classic. Um, who else? On Roly Poly Snack Meals, the longest nickname ever given, which I love. Oh, was he over talking? <laughs> Sorry about this, man. You know, no, at this you're, party, you're... they're throwing things, they're throwing bottles, they're over talking. <laughs> but well, how how did you feel when it first, like, when all the girls walked in? What was your first, like, how did you feel? Like, were you disappointed? Were you excited? Were you nervous? How was it for I you? I mean, put it up there. I was medium rare. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense. I was medium rare, like, mm, yeah, they'll do. Let's see who the hell is who, you know? Exactly. So let's see who the hell is who, man. I, I overall was shocked when I looked over and said, man, saw man Jeezy. But uh, after talking it over with, you know, my brother and, and Jackie Long and stuff like that, man, I got my act together and I was able to, uh, I hate to use the word perform in the same sentence with Mangina. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Quiet, boy. I'm on there. I'm doing something. <laughs> no, right, definitely. Man John is back there. They don't like when I bring them up. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I want to tell you too. Like we're only halfway through. You're Say halfway that again. through, and it's some most entertaining show in a long time. We needed this, especially during quarantine. I was saying we needed this, especially during quarantine. Like this show was necessary. Damn, man. I got a, what did you say that again? No, I said, we needed this during quarantine. Like, it's been craziness with the show already. We're only halfway in. Sorry, bud. Are oh, you good? I couldn't hear you again. 
Oh, okay. I said, we needed this during quarantine. So, like, how has it been, like, just watching back all this new, you know, because this is your first time seeing it all each week. So how has it been for you? Because it's already, B -B, had, like, come over here. so much has gone down. Look at, look, look, look at, look. Look, who, look who's in the house. What's good, everybody? BDB, what's up? What's up? <laughs> you know, man, I, I'm throwing, like, I'm over here at the quarantine, little viewing, man. You know, I got my dog, B to B's, man. You know, she got eliminated, so she's able to come kick it. Uh huh. No. <laughs> we buddies. We buddies. We know. <laughs> Dope, yeah. But, but what, like, how is it different for you from, like, your previous shows? Because it's a whole new age now with reality TV. How, how was it for you? Oh, man. The main thing, the main thing, the, the most different thing about this show, man, is not having our brother real. You know, yeah. not having our brother real, man, makes it, like, sad. You know, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. You know, yeah, crazy, but, crazy. But, but you know, me and I got Micah, and we know Reels right there on set with us. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It took a minute for us to understand and learn that. But you know, now that we know that, come on, baby, stay in there. Exactly. Yeah, and I want to tell you too, like, you got new music dropping. Have my I music know you did what? A theme song for this show as well. You got new music dropping. So how has it been being in the studio and just getting you yeah, know new music going? Oh, man. It's been good. You know, I went in the studio. Hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, you good. Bro, bro. Bro, 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 bro. How can I go around here? Okay, uh, here. Maybe. You know what I mean? Hold on. Sorry, I'm at this. I'm, a, I'm over here at this event, and it's hard for me to do an interview with people looking, sign language in me, and all kind of shit. You know, I'm sorry. I had to come over here in the cut. Now, what was you asking? <laughs> no, I said, like, how has it been? Like, it's so different now because before when you were first on reality TV, you couldn't have cell phones. Like, now everything's social media. Hold on, let me go farther away from this. Yeah, music. I'm sorry, buddy. No, you're I'm good. sorry, good buddy. Time. You know, let me go all the way over here in the cut. <laughs> all righty. Now, what were you saying? I found a little area. Oh, you, no, Man, I was telling you. Like, I'm messing you... your damn balloons. I'm, can, I do, can I do my interview? <laughs> See what I go through, man? I can't even it's a process, it. right? Talk to me, really? man. Yeah, I, I want to tell you, like, before when you started with I Love New York to now, you know, before you couldn't have cell phones and everything was prohibited. It's so different today. Like, how was it with all the ladies having their own cell phone? And do you think that was a good thing or a bad thing? Uh, that was a bad thing, of course. You know, yeah. sitting around with cell phones, just that, that. And if they could have been given a mother goddamn location drop to my house, bro. Yeah. I don't like that shit. You know exactly. what I mean? Exactly. You know, then everybody losing focus and what they do and talking to their boyfriends on the side. So it was a lot I was dealing with, you know? Yeah, definitely. Like, you know, what's really going on in this What's really going on? Exactly. Yeah. And that's, it was a pro and cons with it. You know, I get it. But um, I know tonight, you know, New York's back in the house. And I love you brought her back. Like, how, how has your relationship been with her over the years? Because you have been, yeah, friends for a while, I feel. I got a great relationship with New York. Mm -hmm. I was a little hurt how they talked about me at the reunion. You know, they all yeah. talked about my dog. But besides that, I got a great relationship with New York. Um, you know, I'm always going to have a place in, in my heart. That's why I had to bring a show. And what y'all about to see on One More Chance, man, is some epic reality TV at its finest, man. You know, yeah. Chance, New York, in a whole new day and age. With one more chance with all my girls. Oh man, this is epic, man. This is epic. And New York came on and did her thing. Shout out to New York. I got number love for New York, you know. And I ain't got number love for New York. <laughs> well, I want to ask you too, like this the show's blown up into a whole new for a new generation of kids too. Yeah, that's right. And all them little memes they used to go around talking about today's kids will never know this chance. Today's kids will never know this chance. I want them to take that meme, bro. And yeah. That, oh boy, I said, boy, just take it and show that me. Exactly. Well, I, said, I got all kind of kids, bro. All of my DM kids, I post. I just posted a group of kids 
today on my story, sitting down watching uh, One More Chance. So it actually feels good. I went to the whole new generation with this. Man, I, I, I mean, it feels amazing, bro. You know, I'm smacking yeah. people in their mouth. I'm smacking memes back where they came from. I'm just swinging left and right like I'm going to get you, sucker. Exactly. That's what I love. Like, the whole new generation. It's a whole, and I hope it keep, continues. Hey, I used to look at little stuff going around like that and just sit back, man, and, and just know. And I, I just was like, you know what, man? People don't know your path and people don't know your journey, you know? Mm -hmm. Actually, I, let me run that back. People do feel where you should be going. And it, I know it always disappoints people when people fade away or like a person that a person, uh, uh, you know, we all got favorite entertainers and stuff like that. And when they disappear yeah. or something like that, we never know what's going on. We get sad and stuff like that, you know. But in the midst of that, I was reading things of bashing me, this, that, that, this. So I was using all that as fuel to come back to have the number one goddamn show. You know what I mean? Definitely. And I goddamn did that. Yeah, you definitely did. You still are. Like, I can't, I can't wait for the night show. Like, I'm too pumped to watch it right after this. But, like... What what have you learned about yourself from doing reality TV and bringing it to you places you would never thought? Like, what have you learned about yourself? Oh, man. I'll tell you the most thing I learned about myself. It wasn't, you know, it don't have to do with TV. Well, let me tell you something. First of all, I'm in a different, I'm in a different stage in my life, man. And mm -hmm. one thing I found out is um, I can do it. You know yeah. what I mean? Because sometimes I feel like I couldn't, it took me a long time to come back because I felt like I couldn't do things without my brother. So one thing I found out, found out about myself is I can do it. Like my brother told me when he, on I Love New York, that never left my head because all I could, all I did was play that back and see him always say, it's your time to shine. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? It always hurt me, man. But um, my main thing was, you know, I found out I can do it and, uh, you know, um, it was more like it was more like I found out a lot about myself when my brother died. I found out I had the strength to keep yeah. on alive. I found out I had more strength than I knew I had. You know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. You know, and and, and getting to that strength right there, I think not getting over it because it's still with me. But learning how to deal with that, let me let me it allowed me to continue the journey. Exactly. No, definitely. 100%. Because I couldn't continue the journey as much pain I was going in. I had to learn mm -hmm. how to really, really deal with that, you know? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, going into this show, close. going into my new stuff, I'm like a more mature person. I'm more like humble. I'm more calm. I'm more like um, reserved type. You know, you see, mm -hmm. you, as you see, as you see, you can be a humble, uh, calm person and still and still uh, make great TV. You don't have to, uh, you know, TV is not all, all I don't you know, I'm just at a point in my life, man, where I just want to, um, I just want to give everybody a shot and treat people fairly, man, and, and do what I need to do so I can continue to make a way for the people that I got underneath me. I got young stagnaires. I got my brother. I got little kids, man. I got artists and all kind of stuff. I just want to continue paving the way. And I know if I don't do what I need to do, it's not going to get done. Exactly. No, definitely. So well, I got to do this shit and die trying. <laughs> not, yeah. I, and no, excuse me, die doing. Yep. You got to. You have to. I want to answer too, like with the show. What's been one of your favorite scenes so far, or moments on the show that we've seen so far? Oh man, I, I really like the strip club. I really like. Hold on, huh? Uh huh. Like that strip club challenge. Yeah, man, that was too good. But when Mangina got on there at the end, man, I gave you credit to just walking away, got the hell up out of there. Hey, when Mangina got on that pole, <laughs> had to edit him down. I said, damn, man, I'm sitting at home and I was forced to watch this nigga dance, period. God should have just sat there if Zeus was going to edit this damn man Jeezy in the goddamn clip. Exactly. I was like, no, he didn't. No, he... You I said, I'm, me, for, yo. I'm, for, I'm forced to see you dance? Oh, <laughs> hell no. Oh, you told him, like, yo, you stay over there. We got to do the girls and that's it. And I was dying, but... Nope. Yeah, it was definitely one of the best episodes so far. I agree with you. But I want to ask you too, like, what? what can I say? What's still on your bucket list professionally that you want to do? Because you've done so much so far. I want to see you more in like acting. I see you. You see what? Like you being coming like an actor, like in a comedy. I could see you in. Yeah, that's that's actually my next. You know. That's actually my next move, man. I'm about to go into some films, some uh, movies, some movie roles. I'm actually reading for a couple now. 
you know, uh, one more chance is such a hit. It's kind of like straying me off from doing this and doing that. I know one yeah. thing, one of my main goals right now, I know all the movie, a lot of movie people are hitting me up right now, but one of my main goals, I feel like I really let myself down and the Stallion Air fans down. My main job is to finish this EP right now that is fire. Oh. And the song from the TV show is going to be on the EP and everything. I'm trying to have it done by January. You know what I mean? So I'm dropped that. And uh, shit, man, I, I, I got to knock the reunion out on One More Chance. And then, okay. uh, you know, I, 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 I'm, I'm reading for some movies. My, my, I do, my main thing is to branch off into movies. But I do have a couple projects that I have to finish uh, um, reality-wise first, you know? Don't, I wouldn't don't. say first, but I, I'm, I'm working on some reality stuff right now. So movies, commercials, all that's in the progress right now. I'm being attacked right now. So I'm, I'm really overwhelmed right now, to be honest with you. Yeah, I know. Everyone's saying, too, like, they need three more seasons of this or more because... Yeah, like, I'm like... But <laughs> it, it's one of the best shows ever. It's definitely... I know. I Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. And guess what? If I don't find love, we're doing it again. Exactly. Yes. Yes. That's what I want to hear. We can't just be one season and done it. No, 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 no. If I don't find no love, I'm yeah. going to find some love. Exactly. You got it. Until you find it, you got to keep going. It don't stop, man, you know? No, it don't. I'll be looking. I'll be what? looking. Oh, let me not say that, you know? See, nowadays <laughs> I watch what I say. You know what I mean? Nowadays I watch what I say. Things be right about to jump out my mouth. <laughs> uh, I was about to say, man, I'll be looking like Sister Patterson up on that damn <laughs> thing, man. It's like, he's still doing these damn shows? <laughs> <laughs> like he looked like flames that slashes the Patterson slash. <laughs> God, chance, give it up yeah. already. I, I want to ask you too. Like, I'll be like a hundred. I'll be like a hundred se series in, seasons in, <laughs> and people would still be watching. People would still be watching. Chance didn't had a heart attack, y'all. We didn't seen a nigga die on TV. <laughs> I want to ask you though, who? Out of all the contestants, who were you most amazed by? And who were you like surprisingly, you thought they'd be one way and they're different than once you got to meet them and talk to them and stuff and got to know them? Uh, you know who I was kind of surprised with? You know, uh, I found, I didn't know I was going to get along with Yummy so well, you know? Mm -hmm. I didn't know She's I was going to get along with Yummy. I didn't know I was going to like uh, uh, Snap Roly Poly that much. Yeah. I didn't know I was going to like Yola, you know? You know, I didn't know I was going to learn the. I didn't know I was going to learn to live with Mangina. A lot of things I didn't know, you know? Yeah. I didn't and know. I give, you, I didn't I give know. you a lot of credit for doing the one episode with the all natural thing. How some of the Thank girls you, were. Man. I give myself a lot of credit too. I survived. No. That's what I'm saying. Like, and some girls were not up for it, but most of them were for it. Like, you know what? At the end of the day, at the end of the day, I want to give love and shout out to all the girls that did that challenge. Because I know it was yeah. difficult for them to go on TV and strip themselves from their, what they thought was their beauty. You know? Exactly. But at the end of the day, they looked back at themselves and saw that the beauty was still there. Definitely, definitely. Well, well what you... I think nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what I want to ask you, like, do you ever see you coming with someone else from another reality TV that you would like to do another show with together? Do you ever see anything, ideas you have? Because you got to have a lot of ideas, I'm sure. Hmm. It is some reality people out there that I'm actually liking that are actually funny right now. Okay. Um, but uh, I, you know what? I always want to kind of work with Ray. Because I felt like me and Ray were kind of like, like, kind of like, you know, we kind of were similar in sense, in, in similar ways. Yeah. I'm just more funnier than his ass. You know, that's yeah. why he, he had to do my show and push your boy. You know, he's like, push that nigga. He just, just push that nigga. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, um, I mean, it's, it, I mean, I don't know, you know, I don't know, man. Right now, I, I'm just like focused on me and the Zeus Network. You know what I mean? And I do yeah. have some projects coming up. It's some, I, I'm working with some artists right now. I'm working with some reality people. I'm working on some other projects that I'm going to be producing. You know what I mean? Um, who do I want to work with? It's a lot of people I want to work with out there, man. Do I have to name them all? Do I have to really give you some names? No, you don't have to. No. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely some. I'm not a, one thing about me, bro, I'm not a hater. I love yeah. all other stars and entertainers to make continue making great projects and stuff. You know what I mean? I am mm -hmm. not a hater, bro. I love working with people, bro. Yeah, that's it. Uh, I love yeah. making number one hits. I just haven't worked with too many 
uh, other uh, reality people in this uh, in this business because I was always focused on my own goddamn projects. So and, you know, after this, working on this project, you know, we'll see what's up with one more chance and whatever else I got going on next with Zeus. And then you know, I'll be working with uh, you guys. Will be seeing me doing some hosting and all kind of stuff very soon, man. Very soon. Dope, dope. Well, last thing to wrap up, you know. How was it this time filming for you different? Because cameras are different from this time, like from back then. Oh, no, I can explain it. I was like Mike Tyson, man. I was like Mike Tyson coming back from that fight, bro. <laughs> I was like, bro, y'all worried about these girls when it's been a long time since I've been here. For sure, yeah. You know, I know I'm a pro in this and that and that, but damn, y'all worried about man, Gina and his, the back of his goddamn... I don't know if you call that a ponytail, ducktail, shag, or what. But, <laughs> no, but you know what? I felt good, to be honest with you, man. I just felt like it was a long time overdue. I, You know, it couldn't have been better timing. Everybody's at home, COVID-19, my heart and everything, my soul was built up to make a number one hit. Like, I had yeah. a, I had a built up and passion in my blood and in my soul. So, um, I know it was scary sometimes. It's always scary when you see cameras and shit break out and you wake up and have to realize that all this shit is for you. That's just the point of it is. But after, you know, when you sign your deals, you're happy. But when that day comes, it's like, fuck. It's like, game on. You know what I mean? So, exactly. I don't know. I, 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 I went into this real smooth, man, like a real OG, like real smooth. This is what I do. It wasn't like, no, this and that. It's not like I got to get drunk every day. Like, we was on uh, I Love New York, Real Chance of Love, I Love Money and all them. Cause I see yeah. that phone almost. I can hear you. Yeah, it went out for a second. We good? No, definitely. What do you know? Okay. To wrap up, what else is planned right now? You said you know, what we have to look forward to. And I know sit on the show. One more chance. You got new music. What else do you plan for 2021? 2021, man. Just look out for all the new Stay In There projects, man. I got my artists coming out. I got project on Mike Mike coming out. My brother Mike, he got a whole project mm -hmm. coming out. I got new shows coming out. Man, just look out for the Stay In There's, man. I had to come take 2020 by storm in order to come in 2021 like, what's up? You know what I mean? So it's on. It's on from here on out. I ain't going to stop. I'm never going to stop. You know what I mean? And last one, another body drop. I don't know. You know, then I'm mad <laughs> like... <laughs> I don't know, but you know what? We'll back staying there, back on the saddle, bro. With one more chance, it premieres tonight. I can't wait yes. to see the goddamn episode, man. And I'm here to stay, man. Real reality royalty at its finest, bro. We going yes. all the way in. Well, yeah, bro. Be safe. I can't wait to watch tonight's episode. Good luck on everything. Can't wait to see you. everything for the new year. You know, stay safe, stay healthy, and uh, yeah, bro. I'll talk to you soon. Definitely Thank you, bro. Part two soon. Awesome. You have, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> oh, be safe, bro. Appreciate Thanks, bro. you. Be safe. Many blessings to you, and I'll talk to you soon. Okay, peace. Have a good one.